And hello, today we are looking at prime factor trees. You should know what a prime number is. If you don't, go and check out our video on prime numbers. You should know what a factor is. If you do not know, go and check out our video on factors and multiples. And we know what a tree is. Okay, now this tree, the reason why I've drawn this lovely tree is to help us figure out how to make one. Now this tree is obviously the right way up, but if I was to turn it around, it would look, I suppose, a little bit like this. Okay, the lines go out, it goes down. It almost looks like a, um, a root, doesn't it? So we are going to make a prime factor tree. I'm going to give you some questions and we'll solve them together. And then I might leave you some questions to do at the end, just so that you can test yourself. Right, prime numbers. Now I'm going to list out some prime numbers. We've got two, three, five, seven, 11, 13. And we know this goes on. 14, 15, 16 is not prime numbers. 17, yes. Okay, so what I'm doing there is I'm working through each of the numbers, consecutive numbers, and trying to use my multiplication facts to try and work out, and division facts to work out if they are prime numbers. So here is a list, and we know this list goes on forever. Now, a prime factor tree. This is when I have a multiple. Let's look at number 28. Number 28, I'm going to put it in a square. Now, there are different methods of doing or making a prime factor tree. This is the one that we prefer because we think it's so much more simple and easy. And we like easy. We like quick. We like something that's simple. All right. And the way that we teach it, we hope, hopefully it will be nice and easy for you too. Now, I'm going to use the lowest prime number. The lowest one here is two. So look, I'm going to divide it by two. This line here means to divide, okay? That's what it means. So two divided by 28 is 14. Let's draw another one. And because this was my prime number, I'm going to give it a circle. Okay, I'm gonna draw a circle around it. 14, I'm now going to do the same thing. 14 divided by one of my lowest prime numbers, two again. Circle it, because it's my prime number. 14 divided by two is, I hear you say, seven. Now, seven. What can I divide seven by two? Oh, no, I can't. Three, no, no, I can't. Five, no, seven, yep, yeah, because it is, guess what? It's a prime number. So there, now I can stop. Now remember, factors are the numbers which when multiplied, they give us the multiple. The multiple we were looking at was 28. So we want to make 28. We want to make this multiple out of prime numbers and you're never going to believe what this can now do. When I multiply my prime numbers, it will give me the answer, da, 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 28. Okay, so I have got here a prime number, a prime number, a prime number and my, my multiple. Now remember, these are not just ordinary prime numbers, they are called factors. Hence, hence why we call this a prime factor tree. Not a prime number tree, it's a prime factor tree because these are the factors when multiplied, it will give me a multiple, okay? Now you try. Well, in fact, let's do one one more together. Let's do, let's try 30. I'm going to box my 30. Find my lowest multiple. Two, I can do it. Circle two, because it's a prime number. 30 divided by two is 15. 
Can I divide it by two? No, I can't. What's my next one? Three. Let's try three. And five. Hey, that's a prime number. Circle that. What do I do now? Multiply my factors. Two times three times five gives me 30. Cha-ching. We have done it. Okay. Now let's do another one. Are you ready for another? This time I would like you to try this at home. Try 45. Remember, divide, use the numbers from our list. When you do any questions like this, list out your prime numbers first. You should know them. Eventually you'll know them by heart. And then you can work out some more questions. So let's give you 45. Let's try some more. How about 24? and 36, 24 and 36. Try these at home. Send a, me a picture, take a photo, send it over. Let's have a look at what you guys are getting up to at home. Bye.